one day it had to happen. It did. And it did. Yes, it did. So, yeah, this is a uh, last segment, so I figured we'll get the gang together. Brenna's just kind of off to the side. And, the silent protagonist. Yes. I'm cross-stitching. Uh, Ignore me. Uh, everything <laughs> turned blue. Why? Oh, my God! I just, yeah, I those just are the moves that it learns, and I think it's kind of amazing. So. I realized I messed up with my cross-stitching. I, I, I just the thought of this one Increase night. Increase this attack by yes. <laughs> I don't know what that's all about. Anyway. Uh, final segment. Gym battles. This is going to take, like, five Ten days. years. So, by the time this finished recording, I should uh, visit it. I, I mean, I will be there to visit. Yes. Spoilers for those who haven't been already now. So, I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to do anything in, like, any of these gym battles, because I think I'm underleveled for all of them, but I will try my darndest. Okay, this one's actually not too bad. This is, like... Way lower level than I thought it would be. Yeah, that's kind of pathetic. Because I like, I went to check some of the other ones and. Why do you need your headphones? Because I want to hear my game. So you're just not gonna take part in the video? They're over here. I'm cross stitching. It's not like I have anything interesting to say about gym leaders that I don't know nothing about. I know, but it's just gonna be generic like whining about okay, Pokemon stuff. Okay, I'll grunt every now and then. How about that? Okay. Um, I just thought of something for the Pokemon attack. Instead of raising his attack by yes, I should have put raising his attack by Bagel. Sure. Or Steve. One of the two. Well, they're both random. I should have done Steve. I'll just have one headphone in there. I have to unpick a lot of stuff. Yep, that's not it. So, I gotta love the background of your desktop. I believe it is a purloin. I could be mistaken. It's a purloin. Oh, it's a pure it, ugly. It well, I couldn't. Never be changed. <laughs> it is pure beauty. Did we already get through that gym? Yeah, that was it. <laughs> I kind of sniffed and I oh, looked I'm up. I'm sorry, I blinked. It's over. Like, <laughs> they, I swear they're gonna get harder. Somebody That's watched. What... Somebody it. watched Abraham Lincoln vs. Zombies. It says it's unrelated to the big screen vampire hunter, the great emancipator battles an attacking horde of Confederate zombies. That's kind that of sounds weird. absolutely freaking amazing. <laughs> I will, however, go see uh, the movie Link, and that is my interest. So it's not rated, therefore there will be lots of sex and violence in it. Yes, <laughs> of course. How come like all the non-rated movies have all that crap in it? Nobody knows. I, I am interested. As a U.S. history major, I am quite interested in that movie. It's on Netflix. No, isn't there a new one? Yeah, there's a yeah, new the, one. Yeah, the new one is what I'm looking forward oh, okay. to. They're definitely not looking was, forward to the zombies and vampires. I thought that was already vampires. in DVD. Because, like, I saw an ad at Walmart. That usually uh, means that it's on DVD. Yeah, uh, I, Lincoln, I the movie, is uh, coming out in five days. The one, it's going to be in theaters. I'm definitely going to go see it. Uh, Hitmontop. I love me some Hitmontop. Too bad. Uh, Hitmontop was actually my first shiny Pokemon. Yeah, I got the Tyrogue in, uh... Oh, yeah, in Crystal, the Odd Egg. Yeah, and I, I KO'd the Gyarados each time because I, I knew it was a shiny. I'm just like, yeah, w w what the hell? Everybody's gonna have this. What what kind of item right is this? None. Oh, well. So I KO'd it, and then I got a shiny Tyrogue. I'm like, oh, my God, this def definitely is gonna be a hit my top. Yeah, I so I got one. Yeah, I got, a, um... There goes another gym battle. I'm waiting for these to get hard, because I did try one of them off-screen, and it was level 50, so I'm not just making stuff up here. And it was but, probably the twins. Uh, actually, it was Mormon. But, oh. Anyway, um, let me heal, and what was I going to say? Oh, yeah, in my semi-recent crystal playthrough that I never actually finished, I was using a Hitmon top that hatched from the egg, but I got, like, really sick of resetting, so I just settled for the non-shiny non one, which I think it has straight zeros for all of its IVs. So, I did a little survey on a few online communi communities that I'm a part of about, uh, in regards to Crobat, and about 19 out of 20 people in each community said Crobat is, like, it, it's related to Zubat, it must suck, so... I'm happy to know I'm one of the few people who actually love Crobat. Why is he using a Mareep? Because it's new. <laughs> that is kind of weird. Because it's new. 
Why not use Ampharos? Ampharos is my second favorite. Why you no use Ampharos? Has nothing to do with Pharos in it either. Did he like find a lighthouse thing with an Ampharos? Oh thing? god, I have to tell that story now. It's a very useless story, but it must be told anyway. Yes. So the other day, I forgot what I was. Oh, the other day. Well, the story begins a few months ago. I lost my favorite Nintendo DS Lite, and also the only one I've ever had. Not really, but my mint blue, uh, mint green Nintendo DS Lite that I got with Brain Age DS as a special promo thing a few years ago. And I was, after talking with Brenna and Josh on Skype for a night, I'm like, okay, I got to find this thing. So I decided, um,. I was going to look through my house the next morning, and I did. And then Skype decided to be stupid. Um, I hope it recorded all that. Have I been talking? Yeah. Okay, yeah. just making sure. Okay, I'm not sure what you mean, but... Okay, right. anyway. Mm -hmm. Oh. Okay, so anyway, I tore my third floor and first floor inside out to... Uh, look for my Nintendo DS Lite. Must and always say the word Nintendo. Yeah, well, DS Lite, I'm sorry. Um, so, well, yeah. Never get out. The answer is no. <laughs> no, I think you will not. Yeah, I've got to tell the Tyrannosaur story, um, but you finish, I guess. Okay, so I, I, I didn't find my Nintendo DS Lite, but I did find... A television, a bunch of records, a PSP, a pocket watch, and nine fifty-three dollars in well, nine dollars and fifty-three cents in change. I wish I found nine hundred and fifty-three dollars. And also, I found an well, an a lighthouse with an Ampharos figurine, a plastic one. It just inside the the Ampharos figurine was in the lighthouse thing. I, I'm not really too not really sure. You know where the light is. That that's where it was. So I found it there. It was dusty as hell, but I'm like, wow, this is amusing. I must have done this ages ago. So that's my story. So now I have an Ampharos figuring in the lighthouse. Yeah. That's a wonderful story. Anyway, I'm guessing that like these gym leaders like get stronger if you go back and fight them later on. But because I like looked up a couple of them on Cerebi and. But the main reason that I'm even fighting them again is just because I was hoping I was going to get, like, experience out of it, and I'm barely getting anything, so at this point it's pretty much useless, but uh, oh well. I like how yeah, it took it is. me, like, 25 minutes to get to Flannery, and then I hit her, like, really fast. So, yeah, it's only been eight minutes. Anyway, uh, what was it? Tyranitar story. Uh, I was playing White 2 today, and I find this trainer on... Route, I think 18 it is, who, uh, I went into this fight with, um, my entire team was, like, completely healed and everything. I got out of that team barely alive, I got out of the fight barely alive. He had one Pokemon, and it was a level 70 Tyranitar, and this thing was such a goddamn hacker, I cannot even begin to explain this, like, um... Its moveset I became very familiar with very quickly. It was Focus Blast, Stone Edge, Fire Blast, and Ice Beam. So other than Ice Beam, all of those are imperfect accuracy, but it did not miss a single time. It hit me every single time, it got a few criticals to boot, and it burned me with Fire Blast at least once. Um, meanwhile, I was trying to hit it with Will-O-Wisp, so I could cut its attack stat, and it dodged that move, I kid you not, eight times in a row. Like, I had to keep, like, reviving team members and getting into, like, a Hyper Potion stall fest. I could not hit it, no matter what I did. It just would not be hit. And so, eventually... It died through struggle self-damage. Like, because... Like, the first time it actually took damage in that fight was by the time it had already run out of PP and was starting to damage itself. 
That's how freaking broken that thing was. And my god, did it piss me off. Imagine if you would have had... Did you have any full restores? Uh, I think I did, but... That, did I, the train? Uh, no. Okay, imagine that with two full restores, and do... I don't think full restores, uh, restore PP, and... Imagine if he would have had another Tyranitar, or any other Pokemon for that matter. God. Yeah, it was pretty bad. It must have been holding, like, a Bright Powder or something, because it was dodging those attacks way too much. Imagine six Tyranitars. Yeah. I actually, I actually don't imagine that, 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 because then I'm precluded from this recording. I think I would have cried. So, five gems down isn't this exciting. Still don't know why I'm doing this, but whatever. It is relevant to your interests. Yeah, so much for leveling up, though, so we can tell that, uh, Steven's gonna be really fun. Oh my god, I shoved him in. Uh, oh no, nobody's ever played this game, game before. Jim was like, well, ho hello there, flying type Dratini. How are you? Technically, by Pokedex definition, Dragonair is a flying, well, not really a flying type, but Dragonair can fly. Never heard anything about Dratini ever yeah. flying. Who would have been more accurate to have a Gyarados? Because when you think flying type, you think Gyarados. Yeah, well, Gyarados is flying, so, I, I mean, anything is better than Drag Teeny. And I love how people try to justify that because of, like, the stupid Chinese myth or whatever. Like, nobody cares. It still shouldn't be a flying type. In fact, if it's a flying type, then shouldn't it's al op opposite? Shouldn't it's opposite, uh, well, I guess agreed upon opposite or whatever you want to say. Uh, Milotic also be flying? That's the point. So, I was taking some flying, Gyarados shouldn't be flying. Well, that doesn't mean anything. And like, yeah, fine. I mean, Heracross and Pinsir are, like, counterparts, and Heracross has a second type, Pinsir doesn't, so, whatever. Well, Pinsir just kind of... It, mm. Oh, well, I remember when Sizzler was my favorite Pokemon ever. I'm like, oh my god, Sizzler, it's red, it's shiny, it can, it's, it's, and it's, it's shiny, like a... It turns like Yeah, every other shiny but Charizard. And Rayquaza. And Rayquaza. And Mew and Ditto, because, you know... Yes. Ditto is totally Mew. It, it's a failed clone of Mew. Yeah, I... I, I kind of agree with that theory. But, uh, I have no idea yeah. what I'm doing, by the way. I'm looking for the green button, I guess. The green button will solve all of our problems. Yes. In fact, the green button will just take, take it straight through the credits. I do remember playing a hack that like that where you it was like a puzzly kind of thing, and when you push on the last button, it just kind of it was a Pokemon hack. It just abruptly took you to the um, credits. Okay, then. It was kind of weird. Sounds fantastic. It was. It's the best game I've ever played. Are we done with this puzzle yet? No. I actually prefer this puzzle over the old twi uh, twins puzzle. Uh, that one was weird. The old one reminded me too much of uh, Rocket's Hideout from under the game corner. So let me guess, this time it's going to be a single battle. Because every <laughs> other fight has been a double for some reason. That, that'd be kind of funny. No, it's going to be a triple battle. Okay, so yeah, there's gotta be, like, other versions of these fights. Slowpoke. Are, are you slowpoke? Slowpoke is just hiding behind the HP bar. <laughs> wow, that did a lot of damage there. Don't know why I'm using Flamethrower against a Claydol. It just seemed like a good idea at the time, I guess. 
And Skype has died. Um. It'll take it a second to like get back in. Yeah. You might want to end the call. That way it'll. And then call him back. Okay. I'll just do this in the middle of the video. It's okay. You can do that. How would you rate the overall quality of this call? Very bad. I hope there will be no more of that. So, how about that still being included in the recording? How about, of course, it usually is. If you don't like it, then it's tough. I, I don't really know. Ignore me. Anyway, I, I, yeah, the slow folk hiding is like, nobody attack me. I do not exist. Uh, Let's get some I, input from... I love from... When, when, like, people just keep abusing Protect over and over. That makes the most exciting battles. I, uh, Protect will usually fail in succession, unless the opponent uses it, and then it, it always works. Yeah. So, let's make this in more interesting. Uh, let's get some input from Brenna. What is her favorite Pokemon? Even though she can't really pay attention or hear us, but still. There was actually a whole video on this. Oh, well. We shall now input the, that video right here in the middle of the recording. No, no, th that's not happening. So, what, what do you think is going to be longer, this video or the video I was last in? Uh, probably that other one. I don't see this one going as long, because yeah. it's already, like, going by really quickly. But Five then, days then later. it's going to become terrible at the end, so. You're hoping, you're betting on that, actually. Yeah, if, it, if it doesn't, then I have been building up to nothing whatsoever. Life, my life, and career. Well then, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding. That was Very depressing. Unnecessarily depressing. <laughs> oh god, I'm a part of a new community, a uh, Minecraft community. And I, I wouldn't say I'm... I have made good impressions. I have made good impressions on everybody so far. Except randomly, I'll just make the conversation really depressing. I'll be like, I used to have a girlfriend. Or something like terribly depressing, or we're like, I, I don't know, but everybody just becomes dead silent. They're like, well then, that just happened. So this is the part where um, I am forced to change my move sets. Because, Are we already here? Um, yeah, this is the last gym, and then after this, I have to go through Meteor Falls, and it's going to require Surf and Waterfall, so. I have to do some moveset adjusting. So, to all of those trainers who sp who said on Victory Road, I've spent years be getting all these badges. We just did it all in 20 minutes. Yeah. Yep. I don't want to replace Crab Hammer, but I've got to. Aww. And then Why? Surf. Yeah. Surf goes to Joan, because, you know, big heavy metal thing. You can use Surf. What? what uh, doesn't Snorlax... Uh, I'm thinking get rid of... Let me see, uh... Yeah, well... Decide for yourself. Rock Slide is kind of... Eh. Rock Slide was... It cost BP, so I don't want to get rid of it. Um, I'll get rid of Iron Tail, because it's not going to be helpful against Steel types. Not that Rock Slide true. would either, but still. So. Well, actually, isn't Steel weak against Rock? Uh... Or Ground. I think it's Rock. Yes, yeah, no, Steel is weak to Ground, and Rock is weak to Steel. I knew it was something like that. And then Rock is weak against Ground, too. I see we have an urge to yell in an offensive Spanish accent. No, now I have that sudden urge, but to say it in Spanish. Uh, clearly I will lead with, lead with Coleman in this fight. Indeed. What's with this music when you fight the gym leader? It's like... Well, I'll, I'll get rid of the Rock Slide. Polywag. Yeah, something is amiss. <gasps> Whatever. If we, haven't, if we haven't figured that out yet, something is just ever so slightly amiss <laughs> with these rematches. They're all missing those. Missing those. Just disguises of the Pokemon. How can we make a tough fighter? I know, put level one How can we basic make tough Pokemon. Fighter? Sorry, I had to repeat that. 
indeed. Oh god, well ran. And yeah, this Wisp Cache is now going to be a problem simply because of double team. Like, nothing more oh. needs to be said. Everybody loves a good crowbat with double team, toxic, uh, confuse ray, and whatever else. Doesn't fly matter. just for stalling. It is the best move set ever. I mean, fly isn't really very good for competitive battles, but it can stall, so it, it becomes worth it. I never really understood the point of stalling in Pokemon battles because no matter what you're probably going to lose anyway. If you're stalling, you're probably already losing. Well, if you're stalling because they're going to be taking a ton of damage from Toxic and Confusion, then it works out. This is true. Crab battle! We're obviously talking between Coleman and uh, Walrein here, not the Crawdons. Yes. Because when I think Crab, I think giant thing made of blubber. That would be like the most redundant statement ever. I think crab. I think giant enemy crab. <laughs> Gotta say it in a snake voice too. No. Just, just to be weird. No, 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 I mean it, it makes more sense. I don't know. Hello, Kingdra. Uh, you're definitely Big Dip's favorite Pokemon right there. Yes. One day I will actually use one, and then I'll know what's up. Uh, well, you'll do it. <laughs> I'll know what's up. And then it'll just be the worst Pokemon you've ever used ever. It'll be like, Kingdra ignored commands. Kingdra ignored commands. Kingdra knows, uh, knows. Kingdra used Splash, but Kingdra doesn't even know Splash! And I think it actually can learn, though. Through Horse Day, I believe. Or Egg. Because that, that's something you want to go out of your way to do. Like, I'm not sure. Ooh, it's gonna be really odd. I believe. Uh, does I think using the Selby A glitch in the second generation, the move Splash will bring you will bring you a yeah, it's a Mewtwo egg. I wanted to, I was gonna say yeah, it's a Mewtwo egg. I, I always thought that was funny. Okay, so here we are in Meteor Falls. Oh wow, this video is almost over. We will now, you will now lose 12 times. Eh, it might happen. I don't know. I could get really lucky, though. Or you blow through it, like... I'll fight him, and his team will just not be what it should be, and he'll have, like, Polywag and Marib and stuff. And one air, ten errands, and three Larvitars. I like how I just said Larvitars. Larvitar. Yes. Okay, so here we go. Fun fact, I didn't know where this cave actually was. I had to look at a YouTube video, and after looking at three of them, where, like, they just started out immediately at the fight, I was starting to get very, like, pissed off, and then I finally found one that worked. So, yeah, here he is, and, uh... Wait, you've never actually fought Steven before? No. Well, well this should prove interesting. I'm just gonna be quiet and let you fight the first time with him. Yeah. I don't even good know luck. To start with. <laughs> okay, I'll give one advice. Start with Coleman and uh, good luck. I'm being quiet from here on out. Oh, thank you. I'm amazed you knew where to find me. Did you check YouTube? Oh yeah, I think that's like... Yeah, I, I remember reading that. There was a typo there. He says, like, we fought in the Sutopolis Space Center, but the Space Center is actually in Lost Tape. Just, just, just want to say this real quick. I, I, I did like start laughing when you said, "Did you look at YouTube?" Okay, now I'm quiet. I don't exist. What's with this music? It isn't very Final Bossy. Isn't this the rival music? Anyway, Quick Claw. And yeah, Toxic. That is a strategy that I cannot use against him. But claw again, unless Skarmory is just really freaking slow for some reason. I don't know what that was all about, but okay, one down. And now the worst one. <laughs> well, I guess at least we're getting the worst one out of the way. Um, so you think? Well, I don't think he could have anything worse than this. No, I'm a, you're, you're assuming, assuming you're going to beat him. him. Well, yeah, that's... Okay, well, it's probably going to kill me with Earthquake, 
but I'll try and use Curse and see if I can, like, survive an attack or something. Quick Claw! <laughs> what the crap? Well, or it could do that and then kill me anyway. Okay. So, paralyze it. Not Quick Claw! Um, running out of options. Now I die from Earthquake. Yeah. Okay, and yeah, I don't think I can really do anything against this thing. Um, doesn't that just kind of suck? Oh, ooh, I survived a hit. Okay, Hyper Potion stalling until it runs out of Earthquakes. Or it could do that. Which was also not very effective. Hyper Potion stalling until it runs out of all PP. Or until it gets a critical. One or the other. This, this is, is the new Tyranitar fight. fight. Yes. Why is it switching its moves up so much? That is annoying, because, like, I wasn't counting anyway, but if it suddenly started using a different move, I'd assume it was out of the good one. But now I have no way of knowing. It, uh, AI thinks that you're going to stay at the low HP, so it's not going to want to waste Earthquake. Oh, okay. Meanwhile, I have one Max Revive. Why do I only have one? Oh well. Why is there one of you separate? You go away. I will make a Shadowgate reference and nobody will understand it. So I won't actually do it. Okay, are you out of Earthquake yet? Oh, attack raised. I'm, I'm so happy that happened. Raised, rose, whatever the word is. Um... I assume it's out of Earthquakes now? Never, Never assume. assume. Eh, yeah. Oh my god. Max Revive. Please die from Earthquake. Like, if I can take this one hit, which I know I'm not going to be able to... Ooh, it missed. Thank god. This isn't going to kill it, but at least I can damage it. Oh my god, that did freaking nothing. Why? Why did that not do any damage? It's, it's Metagross. It eats children, children and orphans for breakfast. breakfast. Doesn't Meteor Mash only have 5 PP? I don't actually know. 20! It has 20? Yes. yes! Why? Speed up. Oh my god. I don't think I'm gonna be winning this fight, but I'm going to keep reviving things back and forth until it dies from struggle. This is a viable strategy. Eventually it will miss Meteor Mash again, and I will be able to get in two revives instead of just one. It is, it, this struggle, um, Ooh. stall has worked in the past, so we can be hopeful. What? 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 Its special attack didn't go up. Why did that kill me? the most fruitless thing ever. But that time it didn't. I mean, I know the last one was a critical, but still, jeez. By, By the way, way I lied, it's only 10, uh, 10 PP. Okay, is it gonna start using struggle soon? Oh, special defense fell, that's probably why. Please run out soon, Jesus. Switch because I got the special defense drop. This is clearly the best strategy known to man. It really is, and it's the most exciting one to watch, also. Wait until all your Pokemon are mysteriously replaced with Metapod. No. If it's down Wait to, until. If it's Sorry. down to only Psychics, I can just sit here with Clamps, but I still gotta revive something in case. Okay, that's Shadow Ball. Wait, Wait until, until you both have Gengar, because that know only tackle. Just Gengar can learn that. 
Yeah, fun fact about- Stop getting special defense drops, goddammit. But yeah, fun fact about, uh, ghost types using Struggle. In, uh, the first two, possibly three generations, Struggle was a normal type move, so if you had two ghosts with no- Ghosts with no PP left against each other, they couldn't do anything. Which, Which makes it the most, most entertaining fight in the history of mankind since Team Metapods using Harden. I like how I just tried to use a super repel. I thought it was a super potion. Well, if you can't beat them, repel them. Okay, I think it's down to just Shadow Balls now, so maybe I can start reviving other people. And then it knows Earthquake again. No, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, that would be it. Yay, we're down to struggle. <laughs> Yeah, well, that, did that struggle do a lot, a lot of damage from what I saw? It did get two attack boosts from, a uh, Meteor Mash. Jesus! That struggle did 142 time. damage. And it healed with a Citrus Berry, even better. Luck Hacks. Luck Hacks with Struggle. Then Struggle just oddly paralyzes all of your Pokemon. Come on. Come on, RNG, work with me here. Okay, it did. Thank God I started for those, sorry. The, uh, for those who are going to ask in the comments, RNG is random, random, number, random, number, random number generator. generator. There you go. And then people are going to be like, but I thought you were against RNG. Yes, full restore. You can use one of those. I have like a hundred, so I think I'm going to win this fight just out of sheer determination. This, this is only the second Pokemon. Pokemon. I know, but it is still his strongest one. After Agron. No, I'm just kidding. Agron is pretty bad, though. Doesn't he have a special attacking Agron? Yes. yes. Why? <laughs> because why? Because, because 360. 360. Yes. Not everybody's gonna wonder what, I'm, what I mean. This is so stupid. This is entertaining. As, as soon as you KO it, I'm gonna be quiet head. again. Well, well maybe, maybe not. not. This, this is just probably the most entertaining for me. And I like how I'm showing every single second of it, too. Okay, are we finally ready to kill this thing now? Nope. nope. He's gonna need another full restore. restore. Like, like a boss. boss. Ugh, really? <laughs> full restore and PP up. I am PP up, uh, uh here. here. Well, that was a freaking ordeal. Now everybody gets experience, because everybody got to fight it. Now what do we have? I'm all, though. I hate you already. Um, I will use Surf now. I think, actually, Iron Tail would have been super effective against this, but so will Rock Slide, so... And then Death from Water Pulse. Yeah. Yep. Okay, um... What else would be good here? One, One jerk, jerk out of the way, way just to get to another. Waterfall... Yeah, waterfall. Ugh. Well... Um... Let me take the turn to revive, and then... I'll see if I can paralyze it. Might be helpful. Okay. Yay. Seismic Toss it just for laughs. No, I'll just do this. Oh, oh, I didn't know Thunderbolt would be effective on it at all. Well, yeah, it's oh, on. Rock Bug. Rock doesn't resist electricity, Ground does. It's just how many people will forget that, actually. Because so Onyx can take damage from electric. Yeah, according to the anime, at least. I will use Surf just to be stupid. Oh, he does have a full restore. Why didn't you use it on the Metagross, then? I guess he just gave up on it because it was down to struggle, so. But you wouldn't think the AI would realize that. Okay, Thunder Wave again. Maybe I'll get really lucky with it again. I do know. And attract. And then Marowak out of nowhere with the club. Yes. So, taking my time to heal here, even though it's gonna kill me instantly, probably. Yeah. Moves do you have again? I like how I don't even know what my team knows anymore because I like spend so long like not doing anything with this game. I'm just I know getting up a rollout sweep against this thing is useless, but I'm gonna try anyway. 
because I might get lucky with paralysis or something. Yeah, I figure We're not. Come on, Come on roll out. Don't, don't fail, fail us yet. yet. Well, I, I, knew, I knew it was going to, but I had to try anyway. Oh, well. Okay, three down. Not going to be helpful. Aww. You can't hit higher level of I know, I know. points with it, so... I know. Okay. Oh, that's why I was saying all. Oh, here we go! Must oh, do a... Really, really game? Uh, hey, hey, look at my side. You can do a... I, I guess, steel-plated dinosaur, dinosaur battle, battle instead of a crab battle. But yeah, it's gonna outspeed me and it probably knows Earthquake. Except it won't because it's a special base Agron, because he's stupid, so... Let me, uh... Well, he had Metagross, so why not have a, a, a stupid choice? Oh, it does have Earthquake. Which I somehow lived. For, for now. Yeah. Quick Claw Hacks? Maybe? No, I'm not even gonna try. Um, I'll just... Because you know even if you would've got it, you would've been KO'd anyway, because it would've only done like 10 damage. Yeah, I'm gonna try to paralyze it, so... If you could not hit with thunder, that would be nice. You know, you know he's always gonna hit with thunder. thunder. Why, why, why do you even do this to yourself? And attract, and then it kills me with earthquake anyway, or not? Okay. Once again, I would rather take my time to heal rather than, than actually attack it, and once again, it does that. So now I use my earthquake against you, and it does two damage. Like, I know there's a level difference and everything, but still, really. Um. You. Stop hitting with thunder. No! no. So, basically, I'm gonna be winning this fight because I have a bunch of items, and therefore I didn't really deserve the win at all, but screw it, I, I'm still, like, doing this here. Let's, Let's remember what you've gone through with this LP. You've gone thunder through with Sunny Day up. I think Sunny Day makes it less accurate. It makes, it makes it to 25%. 25%. Really? Yeah. yeah. Okay, Agron's down. Just, Just before, well, before you end the video, video you, you, you need to remember, remember all the good times, times you've had with the series, series. From starting with Brenna, to, to going, going by yourself, to going with me, to through the Battle Frontier. frontier. Yep. Good, good times. times. Good, good times. times have been had by all. And I found a shiny that is not participating in this battle. And then I got a bunch of posts asking me where it came from because they didn't watch that episode. And then I got a post, like... Like, this actually happened today, um, and you can go back and look at the video to confirm it. Um, in one of the Battle Frontier episodes, somebody asked, like, where did the shiny tentacle come from? And said, like, well, you could go back and look at the video to, like, find this out, but that would be too easy. And so then some other person replied to me, like, oh, well, if that isn't a thinly veiled excuse to, like, advertise your own videos, then I don't know what is. Wow, wow, that was kind of pathetic. pathetic. Yeah. Okay, okay and I, I remember the good time when you got a random interview invitation from me. And you didn't know who I was. Yes. Good times. Okay, I am going to attempt to kill this thing through Toxic because Grey Dilly does not die. This is just a fact of life. So, I'm going to die on purpose. Obviously not, because he's just going to... Uh, he got stat boosts. Well, if Cradley dies, they're just, they're just gonna revive him from a fossil, so it you know, doesn't matter. Okay, go to use him, Granny. That'll heal it, but Toxic will cancel it out, so... I don't think there's any way I can lose this, as long as I keep up my, like, revive cycle, so... Let me just get him a hit on it to speed things up. Ooh, and it has Confuse, right? Excellent. Next weekend, when I visit, we must play through all of Emerald, record it, and... Uh, no, I don't know. Ignore me. The next video will be me doing this fight on my actual Emerald cartridge. No, it won't be. Yes! With all level 100 Charizards. Well, I could technically get a team of level 100 Charizards, because I have access to cloning. 
but that would be cheap and, and funny. funny and stupid. Now it must happen. Okay, please just die already. Not happening. Uh oh, this is kind of. No, it's okay. I hope you don't lose. I don't think I will unless he has a full restore, which he probably does, to be honest. But we can hope that he does. Uh oh. Please don't. I'm scared. Oh, thank you. I'm. I'm. I really have nothing to say at this point. Well, and then everything. Hold on. Sorry. What is it? It has ancient power, ingrain, confuse ray, and what's the last move? Have we seen it yet? Giga Drain? No, but it will, it will kill you, so... But I think Giga Drain and Ancient Power both only have 5 PP, so I can once again get it down to struggle, which is by far the most thrilling way to win the best, the last battle in the game, but... This is how all his strategies from now on are going to be. First battle in the game, he's just gonna stall until the opponent uses struggle. Yes. He'll, like, I'll have my, I'll have my Squirtle, Gary will have his Bulbasaur, and I just somehow get it to you, struggle. I don't care how. It will happen. It has, it has already happened, happened somewhere. somewhere. Okay. Are you out of attacking moves yet? I'm starting to think it is. Toxic. Just hit it with Toxic, please. Just hit it with Toxic, please. Just fucking hit it. Okay, gosh. Please. <laughs> no. My God. The game refuses to acknowledge your existence until you raise your voice. There we go. Get Brenna. She has to realize the ending of the fruition that you guys have started. So how long was I in that fight? Like 25 minutes, maybe? 22 minutes. No, that was the final boss. That's it. Fun times were had by all except for Josh. So yeah, um... I don't know what to say about... Foo foo foo! Okay, that, that that made it all worth it. We got the foo 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 in there. Yes. yes. Well, so, yeah, that was Emerald. I don't think there's really any way to top that in terms of sheer stupidity. So Yes, yes there, there is. is. We have, we have one, one more thing, thing to, do. to do. Oh god, what is it? We have, we have to catch, catch everything, everything no. that's available in Owen. No. <laughs> okay, I do believe this LP is over, unless I decide to do some stupid thing, which I'm not going to do. So... By stupid thing, I mean, like, what I actually suggested earlier, doing the fight with my other team, but I'm not gonna do that, so... After however many years this thing has been on and off hiatus, I think it's finally over, and I can move on to greater things, so... Let us hope that this happens, and just for the hell of it, wild Pokémon. I'm hoping for a Golbat. Oh, I had a Repel up, apparently. <laughs> If it's a go bat, I will I will give you one of my pro bats, one of my very awesome soul rock. What a pathetic way to end. Yes. It's very tabooish. It was fun to be a part of this. Thanks for inviting me for this. This was really fun. Well, I needed somebody there because I knew it was going to come down to a stall war. So yeah, thanks for being here, and uh, thanks to everybody watching and putting up with this. Uh, I guess you can expect the Cleffa solo run at some point in the future. I have no idea when. Until that, watch the Conquer Paris and Spiritomb runs on Brenna's channel. And then Conquer from nowhere. Yes. Goodbye.